the terrorists that we are so afraid of, that Homeland Security is enslaving us to uh, submit to and then um, giving the appearance of uh, giving in to, oh, we're not going to do so enhanced uh, pat-downs on young children and so on and so forth as they uh, go around groping uh, at the NFL games starting this Sunday, which is today. So, again, it is the Orwellian double think. You know, uh, they say one thing, do, do exactly the opposite. Um, and if you don't agree, you're a conspiracy theorist. Okay. Anyway, there's a company called Reed Elsevier. Now, Reed Elsevier uh, is a company owned by the Dutch and English interests, the highest interest, elite, Queen Beatrice of the Netherlands, and uh, the Rothschilds and Rockefeller interests sc scattered in there with Queen Elizabeth. Uh, high level New World Order, high level uh, information data mining, among other things, for the CIA and all the alphabet soup. Eric Engstrom is the CEO of Reed Elsevier. Reed Elsevier is a British and Dutch media company that is the leading publisher of information for business and professional users. The company serves four major markets, science, medical, legal, education, and business. How convenient. All the necessary components for the social control, for the agenda. to basically uh, profit as much as possible uh, using Big Pharma to spy upon all the people through the data mining, which is again used by all courts and legal systems. Um, LexisNexis actually came to, uh, I, I've, se I've seen a, a demonstration and they say they like to keep things quiet, they're very quiet about what they do. They publish uh, an incredible amount of uh, documents and uh, journals for the medical and can't, uh, by the way, specifically uh, on cancer research and uh, cutting edge medical technology like uh, spider goats and, and other uh, hideous creatures that have been created at Plum Island and other places like that. Uh, so uh, this is really, uh, again, focusing uh, a tremendous amount of resources to the doctors, the, the, the top 1,200 medical journals used on the cutting edge research and technology uh, are owned by Reed L. Xavier. Okay? They are owned by those 1,200, the top journals that every doctor in the world refers to. These are the, uh, the journals, the, the Bibles of the medical community. Rockefeller, Rothschild, globalists. Again, this is stuff that's just out, out, out there. It's unbelievable. And this is what they do. Putting, profiting off of us by giving us all of these drugs that need to be taken for all these different ailments while they poison our water, food, and, and air, everything around us. And then these globalists, these the Dutch and English interests uh, of the uh, order, annually, Reed L. Xavier produces 15,000 different magazines, books, and reference works, as well as more than 500 online information services and 430 trade exhibitions. Okay, uh, it's incredible. They're all over the country in Boulder. Uh, El Xavier acquires oncology journal portfolio from, can for, from Cancer Information Group on February 2, 2011. Journals provide the highest quality content focused on tumor-specific topics, the company announced on February 2. El Xavier announced today that it will acquire the oncology portfolios of journals of previously published by CIG Media Group, LP, operated as Cancer Information Group. The journals publish peer-reviewed, disease-specific original research, gotta love that, and research articles that disseminate 
cutting-edge data to physicians, medical researchers, and health professionals. Please look into this company. It's unbelievable. These are they're they're they are dictating it. They are putting through. They are part of this whole, you know, uh, system, the Agenda 21 protocol. It's all part of this conglomerate of evil. That's what it is. Um, Glenn P. Campbell, not the singer, Executive Vice President, Global Medical Research for El Xavier, said, We look forward to working with the editorial teams and to leveraging El Xavier's global resources and market-leading online platforms for the continued development of growth of the quality, international profile, and visibility of these prestigious journals. Ooh, I'm, I'm literally getting chills. It just scares the hell out of me. What else do they own? Their other holdings uh, is, uh, basically is LexisNexis. It's a major provider of full-text online information, legal news, business for government, the CIA, the FBI use it, all the alphabet soup, as I mentioned. Uh, they publish also Asia Image, Bookwire, Broadcasting and Cable. They have Cablevision interests, um, CED, uh, C Creative Handbook, the Daily Variety, Variety, Variety Junior, Digital Television, Entertainment Marketplace, Frequent Flyer. Hotels and Travel Index, Hotel and Travel Index International, Hotels, Kemp's Film and Video Handbook, uh, Library Journal, Moving Pictures International. It's a me propaganda uh, uh, force. Multi-Channel News International, Official Cruise Guide, Official Hotel Guide, Official Meeting Facilities Guide, uh, On Production, Publishers Weekly, Restaurants and Institutions, School Library Journal. Star Service, Television Asia, Television Europe, Television International, twice. Weissman Travel Reports, Wireless Week, El Xavier Science, Pergamon Scientific. From the legal, scientific, medical, business, and humanities, journal operations include upward of 1,200 journals, including Butterworths, Martindale Hubble. Book publishing through Reed, through Reed Consumer Imprints include Phillips, Mitchell Beasley, Conrad Octopus, Osprey, Pitkin, Rigby, and Hamlin. Specialized publishings include Elzevier Science, Excerpt uh, Media Communications, Pergamon Scientific, uh, Heinemann, Greenwood, Reed Publishing, Reed Travel Group, Congressional Information Service, Reed, Re Reed Reference Publishing, Har that's unbelievable, Harcourt Religion Publishers, Harcourt Trade Publishers, Harcourt School Publishers, Holt, Reinhardt, and Winston, Steck Vaughan, Hardcore Canada, Hardcore e-learning, Hardcore College Publishers, Hardcore Education Measurement, Hardcore, 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 Drake B. Morin, Hardcore Assessment Systems, Hardcore, 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 The Psychological Corporation, Academic Press, Morgan Kalpin Publishers, Churchill Livingstone, Hardcore Health Services, Gems Communication, MD Consult, Mosby Incorporated, Medical Publishing, uh, it's just unbelievable. That, my friends, is Reed El Xavier. More horror from the New World Order. Look at this. Look at that. Libya struggles. Okay, is and in Greece they've already burning this this guy is burning himself outside of a bank. He set himself on fire. It's just unbelievable. A man sets himself on fire outside the branch of Parisis Bank in the northern port city of uh, Thessaloniki, Greece, Friday. It was the third attempted self-mutilation. Oh, he didn't die. By the former small business owner who says he was ruined after taking a series of bank loans. Yeah, like Monsanto ruined the farmers. And a thousand of them a month to this day are committing suicide because they were promised this. Uh, this, these abundant crops, and meanwhile, all the crops fail and, and they poison the soil, and <laughs> they're just killing themselves by drinking the Monsanto uh, chemicals for the uh, for the the crops, which is of course poisonous. So this 56-year-old uh, was hospitalized with non-life-threatening chest burns. Yeah, certainly made a statement. You know, every he's crazy. He's crazy. Yeah. Horrible. Libyan struggle. Gaddafi loyalists beat back the assault on the strongholds as Al Qaeda is given a seat on uh, 
in the United Nations for Libya. It's just unbelievable. It goes on and on and on. Enough for one day, ladies and gentlemen. The battle rages on. Don't assume it was left by accident. If you see something, say something. Vice President Dick Cheney takes a question from David Rockefeller. Vice President, uh, I just enjoyed so much your whole speech, but I was particularly pleased that you gave such a strong endorsement for the free trade agreement for all the Americans. Subject that has been of great concern to me for many years, and particularly recently, and I think it's absolutely essential for the strength of our economy. The terrorists that we are so afraid of, that Homeland Security is enslaving us to uh, submit to and then uh, giving the appearance of uh, giving in to, oh, we're not going to do so enhanced uh, pat-downs on young children and so on and so forth as they, if you don't agree, you're a conspiracy theorist. Okay. Anyway, there's a company called Reed Elzevier. Now, Reed Elzevier uh, is a company owned by the Dutch and English interests. Uh, go around groping uh, at the NFL games starting this Sunday, which is today. So, again, it is the Orwellian double think. You know, uh, they say one thing, do, do exactly the opposite. Um, and if the highest interest, elite, Queen Beatrice of the Netherlands and uh, the Rothschilds and Rockefeller interests, scattered in there with Queen Elizabeth. Uh, High-level New World Order, high-level uh, information data mining, among other things, for the CIA and all the alphabet soup. Uh, Eric Engstrom is the CEO of Reed Elzevier. Reed Elzevier is a British and Dutch media company that is the leading publisher of information for business